the actor, and you don't want an actual serious actor, so you try to kind of find a middle ground, I guess. I can't, who could have played, better, who'd played, who'd played that role better? Who would play that role? Matt yeah. Brothers from the Ben Stiller could have yeah. played that role, and he was no. in it. Ben Still could have done it, but I, uh, I don't know. Been, I, he makes every role he does as awkward as, as it could possibly. The yeah. whole time he's in character, How dare you make me bleed my own blood? Watching, you know? <laughs> Nobody um, makes me bleed my own blood. But like, Nobody. They, they literally could have gone with just an unknown Sounds for that role. so yeah. Asian. You know? Right. <laughs> I don't know. He was speaking some kind of language. I don't know what it was. Sounded it sounded Asian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, number four, uh, Seth. Uh, this is forty. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. One movie I've seen all the way through. Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah, okay. it's a good You're movie. Like, no, because I, I like Paul. I like Paul Rudd. Yeah. At this yeah. point. And it's yeah. like it's Paul Rudd. It's like Paul Rudd is great. There has there's not a lot of things. Even even his role in Clueless wasn't bad. Uh, okay, yeah. His. I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm this, sorry. That, his that statement. Fucking sorry. Say, his, fucking sorry. His appearance. Shit. On, <laughs> his appearances on Conan just win me over every time. Yeah. He plays Mac and me every time. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez. What do you Damn got for? Fucking Jesus. I, I I'm okay with. Help me, Jesus. I'm, I'm okay with. Help, help me, Jewish God. Help me, Jewish help God. Me, help me, help me, Tom Cruise. Do it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Don't you do it. Yes. I'm going to do it. <laughs> Don't you do it, Ricky. I'm gonna do Don't it. you put that evil on me, Ricky Don't Bobby. Don't you put that voodoo on me, Ricky Bobby. Don't <laughs> you put that voodoo on me. It's like it's it's like a, it's like a pancake, but it's, it's rolled up. It's like, it's yeah, that does sound pretty good. good. No, yeah, break it, Frenchie. <laughs> <laughs> break it. Oh, jeez. Talladega Nights, by the way. Nights, yeah. yeah. That didn't make my list. I want to go fast. <laughs> <laughs> you know the, the, the if best. If you ain't winning, you're losing. The, yeah. the, the line I stole. <laughs> I'm gonna come I'm at you like I'm a spider monkey. I'm gonna scissor kick you in the head. I'm all jacked up on Mountain Dew. Oh, not my prison shank. <laughs> the, line, <laughs> the line that I still use this day, whenever we're talking about like work, I say I always say, "Well, every morning I wake up, I just piss excellence." <laughs> oh, I, 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 we have read it quite often. The, the, the <laughs> best, the best, the best line. The best if line. You don't cheat, Big Red. Right. Fuck you. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> what, was the, what, was the, what was the one his dad said when he literally like shut the door and the tigers in the back seat? Oh, he's like, uh, uh, you've got to you've got to zone in and, and just freak. <laughs> he's not there. <laughs> the fucking, yeah, that, what was it? That, yeah, you the mountain lion. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, nope. Yeah. No, you need oh. to see the movie. You, you, yeah. See, for me, oh. that movie has three over the top: Sasha Baron Cohen. Will yeah. Ferrell and John C. Riley. Like, yeah. God damn, that's too much. You know what, Sasha and Baron Cohen? And then it has that. Sasha Karen, Barrett Cohen's best movie. What's his best movie? Yeah, what, do you, what would you think? What would you say is the funniest movie? Oh, jeez, I don't know. Maybe Borat. Maybe I gotta go. The Dictator. That Man. had me laughing so it, much. It was, it, was, it was pretty good. It's it like was. all the other ones. There's a lot of stupid comedy, but this one actually no. hit me in the right spot. Every single joke hit me. It, it might have been the time frame. Maybe you know, that all the stuff was going on. You know, that was a pretty good time to yeah. release that yeah. film. So. It's, a, it's a girl. It was the trash can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh man. Oh, away. All <laughs> right. Is it my number four? You, yep. have, her- you have herpes. Is <laughs> <laughs> sexy time. <laughs> <You have> herpes. <laughs> uh, Wonderless. It wasn't Wonderless number four. Yeah, mine was high up there. Awesome. Yeah. Again, because Paul Rudd, Jennifer Aniston. Uh, yeah. Yeah, she's that's so fucking hot still. The, I know she she's is. She's crazy, in her fifties. She is amazingly. Why is she batshit crazy? Why do you think she's batshit crazy? I'm going to stop there because she didn't want to get molested by Harvey Weinstein. You put me on the Weinstein spot. I'm just talking about the stupid Raider interview where she lost her shit in the middle of her stuff. You know, it happens to the best of us. Oh, it does. Yeah, it doesn't happen to me. Uh, <laughs> do we need to go to the? Don't bring up the. Don't do it. <laughs> don't you fucking do it. <laughs> See, as I said about technology, there uh, is proof of things yeah, that yeah, you have done. So. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. But no, that. Uh, and then that fucking. The guy who ran the. The commune on Wanderlust. Mm-hmm. That shit was great. It was good. Yeah. It was good. I was embarrassed several times because, of course, the, the first time I watched it, my it was mom with your mom. was there. Yeah. And it was just like. And I'm just like, he hey, said, this is fucking hilarious. And I was literally watching that scene unfold in the, in, the, in the bathroom. And she's like, oh my God. And I was like, Mom, you were a dancer. Okay? You were a dancer. All right. That's yep. it. Done. <laughs> Number three. What you got? Number three. I went with 
Battle of Ricky Bobby. Battle of Ricky Bobby. Ricky Booby. Ricky Booby. <laughs> 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 like, sticks to the roof of my mouth like peanut butter on the <laughs> Oh, man. All right, what you got, Seth? Number three? Uh, I've got Forgetting Sarah Marshall. Yeah. 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 You go, Seth. So yeah. we are getting some connectors here. Yeah, yeah. man. Yeah. Mila Kunis. Yeah. She, she's, you know. Yeah, she was good in that one. She she's too good. Russian for she, me. I figured you'd fucking Trump supporters would like her. Oh, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid, horrible joke. <laughs> oh, you liked it. Did you hear about the Pokemon Go thing with Russia? That's pretty funny. I did. What? They, were put, they put on their Tumblr feed for all these uh, Black Lives Matter supporters to play Pokemon Go in areas that cops have shot black people. Wow. Oh. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Fucking wow. ru- rush you up to those shenanigans again. Fuck yeah, hell. You're putting me on. <laughs> I need to move to Russia. You're such a funny guy. Are you going to go join Steven Seagal? Yeah, man. He can protect me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's sorry. He can yes, say that. He, he's a Russian citizen now. Russian yeah, I know he is. Yeah. Yeah. But he's Fucking also fat. Idiot. He's also fat mm-hmm. and... Not anything he ever said he was. He's definitely not. I trained with Bruce Lee back in the set. Bitch, you were 13 when fucking Bruce. Fuck off. Like I said, he taught me how to read. (laughs) (laughs) I'm still learning. Yeah. (laughs) It's a lifelong. Vladimir Putin. Get the fuck out of here, Steven Seagal. Oh, you did. Good. Now stop doing anything. Number, uh, what was my number three? My number three? Uh, My number three. three. My number three was Anchorman. Anchorman, yeah. My number three. uh, Oh, shit. How did you go to sing? Knocked up, yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah, that's a that's a film role that kind of killed Catherine Heigl's career because she bitched about it. Yeah. Oh yeah. well. That's what I'm saying. We're not missing her. No. I don't. Not, yeah. Well, I never understood the I whole Catherine Heigl thing. The, well, the only movie I liked her in was uh, he uh, probably gave me flack for this one too since the clueless statement made you, uh, which was uh, shit. I can't remember the name of the movie now. What was it about? I'm definitely gonna give you flack for that. <laughs> what is it about? It. Uh, shit. Who else was in it? That one guy from yeah, Miller. that one guy from Name that thing. One word that was said in the movie. <laughs> it was it was a rom com, but the ugly truth. Of course it there was. you go. There the ugly truth. What yeah. with Jerry Butler? Yeah, the I was trying truth. to think. Of, I was trying to think of Gerald Butler's name. Yeah. I was like, ah, it's not Gerald. It's Gerard. Gerald. It's not Gerard. Gerald. The guy from Three Hundred. It's Jetted. Jetted. <laughs> you have to scream it when you say it. He's Jetted. Also- Jetted. <laughs> what movie was that? The ugly truth. The ugly truth. It, it was actually pretty I, good. I like that movie because of of Jerry Butler. Right. Yeah. But but her role wasn't. It didn't make me hate her. Yeah. Well, she played. This is the thing. But she look, played a hateable character you're, too. You're playing the same character in everything you do. Yeah. Uh, that's what's feeding you right now. That's what's feeding all them stolen African babies you have in your house. I know you call it adoption. Whatever. <laughs> but, but, tomatoes, tomatoes. Right. Yeah. Why don't you tell me what the word for the adoption is in the language of where you just took that baby? Yeah. Chakra. <laughs> Swahili. <laughs> Sorry, that's uh, terrible. Number two, what do you got there? No, Not terrible, but I true. get confused when they start speaking because it's hard to interpret with all the flies buzzing around. So. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, number I'm two, <laughs> I, man, I went with super bad. And you'll see, now you're starting to see like kind of the architecture of the way it was. Every time they brought out a movie that released a new set of characters and stuff, it, it stepped up and quotability factors. Super that was bad definitely was amazing. Yeah. yeah. You know? When, when he, the, my favorite scene is definitely other than the McLovin part, which McLovin's cool. We hung out with that dude, right? Chicka, yeah, chicka, at, uh, yeah. at uh, uh, Lola's. At, yeah, we were at Lola's and party. He's an awesome dude. Um, but when didn't mind when, when you call him McLovin in the party, and like everybody's like, "What the hell?" And he's just like, "Oh my god!" Like there's just blood all over his leg. Yeah, oh, fuck. dude, you got period blood that on your pants. Was, were you dancing like, with a chick my in there? Yeah. I love that whole thing. My favorite thing of Superbad was, uh, I think that was one of Seth Rogen's best roles. The cop, yeah. Seth Rogen and uh, uh, what's his yeah, name? Yeah, those were the coolest uh, cops ever. Right. I did not mean to block your cop. <laughs> 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 they had to, t- had to do that scene like fucking 50,000 times. I would imagine so. He's the best kid. He's the best kid ever. He's the best kid alive. alive. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't worry, it's just beer. It's just a beer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. That's a good. That was a good movie. Uh, yeah. Oh my god! Number two, Seth. Funny people. Uh, okay. Yeah. 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 Nice. That's a good one. I can't believe it was so low on your list. I didn't even believe you make your list. Sorry. Yeah. I'm a dummy for not putting it on my list because I really do like the movie. Yeah, it's a good movie. Yeah. Yeah. A lot it, of people well, don't like, think like, well, like, well, like, like you said, it, by itself, though. right? You know, without this, li- yeah, it didn't fit. It up. didn't fit the mold of what I've already had, right. of the group yeah. I had on here. Yeah. So. 
right. uh, my number two is also super bad. Super bad, yeah. <laughs> the fucking scene where you try to steal the liquor. <laughs> He's never had a choice. Never had a choice. <laughs> and he like, hits the Don't grandma. Do it, kid. He hits the grandma. Oh, you fucking killed her. You fucking killed her, man. <laughs> yeah. Good old, uh, good old Jonah Hill's fat days. Yeah, well, he's still fat. Well, he's well, he's, he's fat now. Oh, he's, yeah, he slimmed he up. Only, that he last slimmed role. down. He slimmed up for Twenty One Jump Street like ten years ago. Uh, he slimmed Dude, up I watched that movie after that as well too. Yeah, uh, Twenty Two Twenty Two Jump Street. Hey, something else. Which one? War, was it War Dogs? No, no, he was Wardogs fat as no? fucking War Dogs. Oh yeah, he, well, no, he slimmed down. There was there yeah. were two scenes that they did, and, and it was like towards whatever he was yeah. a slimmer. And then he did another role in a movie that I haven't seen released yet. And he's uh, a slimmer character. I just wanted to mention the yeah. fact that uh, just a couple of weeks ago, I watched 21 Jump Street again. I fucking love that movie. I do, too. That movie is so goddamn I funny. I like the, was it the sequel, and they're talking about when they're like doing all the, all the, 20, uh, the next movies, right? And they have Seth Rogen sit in because yeah. of the yeah. contract yeah. dispute. Yeah, yeah, that part was funny. Yeah. The, the whole fucking movie, dude. Part, and I'm not a huge Channing Tatum fan. Yeah, but he was perfect for oh. that role. Like, the funniest thing that Channing that. Tatum was ever in was, this is the end. <laughs> I hate that movie, but oh, there the are movie some is, great the movie is funny dumb as shit. It. But the part where oh. <laughs> fucking what's his name, Michael Sarah slaps uh, fucking be, uh, I, Rihanna's ass, yeah, <laughs> and she just fucking like straight poof, yeah. It. And then they open the door, and she's like, "I just want to see Michael Sarah's dick," and, and like he's like, and they're like totally blowed out, like yeah. naked chicks. He's just like, "Shut the damn door." <laughs> I read a, I, I read a, I read this trivia thing on, uh, on Hermione. On Hermione just kicked our asses. <laughs> where, uh, <laughs> where Michael Sarah didn't want to actually make contact with Rihanna's ass, and like the way that they were filming it, he was trying to do it where he didn't actually do it, but they couldn't get it right. Yeah. So he actually asked her. He's like, "Can I just slap your ass?" She goes, "All right, well, as long as I can actually slap your face." And he's like, "Okay," but what she didn't tell him was that every take that he couldn't get it right, she would slap a little bit harder. And a little bit harder, and a little bit harder. So the slap in the movie was one of the hardest ones, and it was real. Good. So nice. both slaps were real. Good. Yeah. Nice. I had a fucking whale on her ass then. Yeah. I would have noticed. Bam. Like after the third take, yeah. Yeah. Uh, this bitch is getting fucking hotter. All right, oh cool. yeah. One 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 I, phrasing comes to mind, and that was a uh, what was that? Butt bongo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> pull out, I actually pull out your Chris Brown. Okay. Yeah. Right. <laughs> hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. You want to write another hit? <laughs> we tell girl with your umbrella. We, we tell girl uh, with two black eyes. Uh, Nothing. You already told the bitch twice. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, Joe Rogan. Uh, we stole, uh, more yeah, we stole, stole another joke. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> you know what? I actually wrote this is the end down on here as a. Uh, I wanted to talk about it. Yeah. Because uh, is that that's a produced right? Well, no, no, no. He wasn't. He, he wasn't involved in it. Yeah, but I think he had any credits on it. but yeah. Seth Rogen directed it. Yeah. And if it wasn't for Apatow, Seth Rogen would never have existed. Right. right. Mm-hmm. So I put this is the end sausage party in the interview on here. Oh, sausage party. Those movies are hilarious. Yeah. And I love this. I, I, you said you didn't like This is the End, but I love This is the End because of how meta it was. And I've always wanted to see a movie where everybody played themselves, and then they actually died and all this shit was happening. It was hilarious. Uh, yeah. The, great, Loved the it. great part of that was Aziz. Fucking somebody help. No, nah, man. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah. Dave, Dave bailed on his ass. He's like, dude, just like in life, you are a fucking loser. <laughs> and fucking Paul Rudd was late and he had the pie. He's running yeah. up. Oh, I miss anything. <laughs> what the fuck? James yeah. Franco's like insane infatuation with fucking Seth is amazing. I got this picture and like, yeah. Yeah. He's yeah. like, yes. he's like, it's just art, man. Me and you, we're both art. Oh, really? It's the power of Christ man. compels me. Really? <laughs> oh, really? Oh, really? <laughs> it's really compelling right now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh jeez, my number two was shit. yeah. My number two was Get Him to the Greek. I knew nice. It. I, knew it. I like see the thing though that really sold that movie for me was the fact that that really was uh, Rose Bryan singing. Yeah. All of all the songs. She's one of the ones that you know. The I'm talking about my asshole. Thank mm-hmm. you. <laughs> great, dude. And then it was Russell Brand doing all the other songs, like the songs he sang in there. He actually went to the studio and sang them. Yeah. That guy's a fucking performer, man. Yeah. And a lot of people don't agree with him politically. I don't really fucking care. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care. The guy can fucking perform. Yeah. He's, uh, he can I, be funny, yes. He's very. I think he's a very talented uh, performer. I just know. You sound like you're from London. <laughs> Number uh, no honorable mentions. No, no I was just going to talk about what I just talked about. Oh, okay. We, we, did we go to number one? Now we go to number one. Yeah. All right, so for number one, I had to because this is like my generation here. Uh, Happy Gilmore, man. What? Uh, yeah, he is uh, apparently credited with a uh, writer on that. So 
because he uh, rearranged the credits. It, 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 I don't, I don't know, bro. Okay, but the fuck the did Judd Apatow do again, on Happy Gilmore? Again, thank you, IMDb. I love you guys.